meet everyone and welcome back to my pagan life. You know, I'm starting to post some more videos and you know, we're getting there, but I still have a lot to work on. But oh well, I hope you guys will be as hyped about this as I am. I just came home from school, I do not look my best, but I hope I look decent, and I really don't know how to start off this video because this is so exciting, I can't even. All right, all right, enough with the suspense, I get it. It's this. The most recent thing I bought off the internet was Scott Cunningham's uh, Wicca book, you know, Wicca, a uh, guide to the, uh, for the solitary practitioner or, you know, something like that. And even then I was excited because I never buy things off the internet. I just like buying things in person because, you know, buying things off the internet can be pretty sketchy. But I've come to the realization that a lot of services are really trustworthy and this time I have bought something new from Wish. Wish is very very cheap. I know I need to stop talking because we need to get to the stuff but if I'm correct this is the one thing I've been waiting for. It has my name and my address and everything on it so it's about time to pack it up and just take it out of this whatever this is and I'll show you. All right, people, it's about time to get this open. See, see, see this, see this? This is off, I, th I think, what? How does this work? I guess this is all just plastic one has to rip off, but oh my goodness, it's even, it's even like this, this thing right here. It's even a bit in Chinese because you know, a lot of things are shipped from China. At this point, I just have to rip it open. <gasps> no way, <gasps> no way, you're kidding. I'm sorry guys that I'm I'm so hyped for this, but it's it. Wait, wait, you guys still don't know what it is, but uh, you'll figure out soon enough. Yeah, I've had a long day, don't worry about my hair. My gosh, wait, wait a second. I, I, oh yeah! I never thought I'd do this in my entire life, and now it's happening. <laughs> guys. Look at this. This thing right here is a medieval cosplay party dress. So let, let me see if I can get a better look at this. My goodness. Do you guys see this? It's got even arms like this. I'm going to feel so witchy. <laughs> and look at the bottom. C can you see the bottom? Yeah. It's practically out of the Middle Ages. Or, or, or maybe not. I don't know. Medieval. You know, it's medieval. I I can't believe this, guys. I, I've done it. I feel so accomplished because I felt like it was just like, okay, I'm just gonna do this, and, and it's happened. I'm proud of myself. I gotta stop being so excited and actually get to the interesting stuff. I'm going to go now and put this on, and then I'm just going to see how it looks. This is actually happening. Look at this. You guys have no idea how long I've been wanting something like this. I've wanted this for years now, but I've always been putting it off because I've had to buy it off the internet and I've been like, nah, nah, nah. I don't need it. I don't need it, okay? But now, now I have it. <laughs> and it was so worth it. I don't know, what do you guys think? I mean, I chose the color green because it suits my complexion the most. I could have chosen purple, I could have chosen even black, white, uh, blue, uh, but I chose green and uh, I'd like to hear what you guys think. Not only just the color, but also what do you think about the outfit in general? Like, would you guys like something like this or does, does this look interesting to you? Oh, and also guys, I'd like some fashion tips from you guys. I'm actually planning on going to a medieval middle ages festival that will be in uh, Oslo, you know, capital city of Norway and it's close to where I live. They're having this festival they apparently have every single year and this may be the first time I'm attending that festival. There are a lot of things I can do there like uh, buy things and go and look at shows and look at people fighting with swords and shields and you know, it sounds amazing and from what I've seen, it looks amazing, and I'm going to go there, I think. I am- I've been planning to go there, so I wonder what it's gonna be like if I go there. But anyway, guys, back to the style tips. Actually, this dress, I'm glad I didn't pick it in large, and I took medium instead, because this one can be a little bit too big, but I don't know what you guys think. Maybe it would be complete with, like, a typical, like, middle-aged belt or something, like a rope 
or something of the like. Maybe a different style braid. I don't know. What do you guys think? This is like my main go-to situation, but I can either loosen my hair like this and just let it flow and just, you know, my natural self usually. Or I could of course go with the style that I oftentimes want to go with, but that I don't do that often, which is this style right here and just put a little bit of hair in front of the ear and, you know, let it be a little bit loose, sort of. Always make sure in these dresses to keep your head held high and um, your shoulders backwards. <laughs> or, you know, leaning backward. <laughs> but anyway, guys, I've been glad to chat with you. I hope you guys liked this video and that you were just as surprised as I was and let me know in the comments what you guys think. I'm probably going to be posting it all over the Facebook group and all over the Instagram group, all of that. So feel free to share wherever it might be, whether it be on Instagram, Facebook, or here on YouTube. So anyway, guys, thank you guys for watching once again, and uh, blessed be from my pagan life until we meet again.